My name is Michael Pittman. I'm a visual artist from Newfoundland and Labrador. Uh, I've been painting professionally for, well, I guess since about uh, 2006 when I finished my master's degree. Uh, I did my undergraduate studies in Newfoundland and Labrador at Memorial University and uh, graduate work in Ireland at the Waterford Institute of Technology. Uh, uh, I was invited over on scholarship after doing some work with a publishing company that had a lot of a lot of ties to Ireland at the time and uh, and we went on from there. Um, this this show is uh, is not the first time I've shown work at View Art Gallery. Uh, I've been sending work out for a while. It's my first first opportunity to come here to uh, to participate in an opening, which has been uh, which has been excellent. I show uh, a lot of my work in St. John's, Newfoundland, at the Leighton Gallery of Fine Art, and I presently have a large, very large uh, solo exhibition on at the Rome's uh, Provincial Art Gallery in, uh, in St. John's, Newfoundland, Labrador. Um, which is, uh, it will be up until August 22nd, it'll be up all summer. It's got some, uh, a lot of painting, uh, some of which is very strongly related to the work here, and it's also got some sculptural work. It's got some, uh, I was, I was uh, making some beds for a while uh, out of uh, galvanized steel. There's some uh, kinetic sculpture there, or intended to be kinetic, uh, uh, elements of pneumatic automation and, and things like that. And uh, uh, yeah, so, uh, uh, that's that's uh, sort of what I've been doing for the past uh, past little while, and uh, excited to be here, and uh, hope a lot of people come out and check out the work. So, a little bit about the show. Uh, this body of work uh, relates to uh, uh, the show that I have in Newfoundland right now. I was I started out working on a, on a large body of work which related to uh, ideas of traps and trapping. Um, I first thing I did was rush out and bought two boxes of coyote traps and started drawing and, and painting and uh, you're sort of uh, looking at those and, and, and trying to create images that that related to those very strongly. But I got I got bored with that very quickly. I did some early work that was very representational, very you know uh, you know very specific you know, representations of, of traps, and it, it's just stopped appealing to me. Uh, I try not and I try not to restrict any sort of lateral movement when I'm when I'm working like that. If uh, if I get tired. Uh, or disinterested with an idea, I often move on. And so the work, all of the work became uh, more uh, closely tied to a general idea of trap or trapped. Uh, a lot of the work relates specifically to ideas uh, surrounding uh, uh, the domestic, domesticity, uh, you know, uh, things that happen to people every day, uh, uh, elements of anxiety and, uh, and things like that. So uh, it became less, as I said, less specifically related to sort of trapping and more, uh, more related to you know ways that people uh, associate with with that idea of being trapped in everyday life. So you know we can see here you've got images of uh, of houses. Uh, there are images of of dogs. You know on leashes. There are images of of old broken down pickup trucks. You know um, some of them you know are, are obscured. Some of them are more or less you know uh, direct or clear. But there's all these elements that one would find uh, find in, in everyday life. Uh, you know, uh, many of them deal with issues of anxiety or or, or tension. Uh, you know, they incorporate uh, objects that we would recognize from you know family outings as a child. They would. So so that's that's what the work became about for me, and that's what held my interest throughout the process. You know, we've got uh, we've got clotheslines and, and dresses that reflect sort of these angelic shapes, and you know, uh, uh, and being 
being a surrogate or a decoy for a human butt figure or body. Um, so I think I think there's a there's a lot of different things happening here, and it kind of carries me through. Uh, uh, probably near my my next body of, of work. Uh, I think it's really interesting for me transitional work into into where uh, where things are going to go for me next.